In this video, we'll be creating a dynamic pop-up system in Godot. This is a really good project for beginners as it can teach you the basics of the timer node, instancing objects at runtime, modifying data from other objects, and automatically deleting objects after a certain amount of time. So this is going to be a different type of tutorial. I'm going to be showing you what I have done, and then you should hopefully be able to follow. So let's get into it. So here in the first scene, all I have is a control node and the button. This is going to be the scene where you create pop-up, and then you want to have a script that goes with it. You want to do an export var display time and make it a float. And then you also want to do a text to show and then string. And then you can just set that to whatever you want. And then we need to create an on ready var and then set this to our pop-up prefab pretty much. Set it to load and then the path to that prefab. And then whenever this button is pressed, we want to create a new pop-up scene. We want to change the show time on it the text to show, and then add it as a child to this control node here. And then in our pop-up node, we have a control node. It's pretty simple. Then we have a color rect at the bottom center of the screen with a label in it taking up the entire thing. And we also have a timer parented to the control node, and then this will be the thing we'll be modifying. And then in our script, we have a text to show. This is just a public variable and we can just say this is a pop-up show time uh how long it goes up on the screen and then we do on ready and then we do color rec slash label dot text so this labels text and then we set it to text to show and then we do timer dot start and then the start function takes in a time so we just pass in our show time and then we send a signal to the timer to the script and then whenever the timer finishes, it just queues free. So to show you this in action, I'm just going to press run real quickly. And then I can do show pop-up. And then we can see it displays some text here. And then after five seconds, I believe, it should automatically go away. And yes, it has. And then I can just modify these variables in the inspector so I could have it just like that much. And then I can change the text to like, hello, fun, noober something like that run it go pop up we can see it's barely on screen at all and it says hello fun huber so if you like this video be sure to like and subscribe it helps out the channel helps get content like this recommended to others i'll be making more modular good videos in the future so subscribe for that ring the bell for that and that is all from me for now fun huber out